So greetings all, this is the, the ancient one with my student James, he's a helicopter pilot and instructor. And what, in your words, James, what are, are the similarities for instructing piloting, if that's the word, and uh, learning golf? and meaningful repetition. Meaningful repetition. the right way the first time and keep practicing the right way. Wow, that is words of wisdom. So, James is an excellent student and it's kind of life-threatening if you don't do things right with a, pot, with a helicopter, right? Yeah, yeah. I hate to see him uh, come in. That's probably a million dollar machine in a lot of cases. But we're, we're working with a little ball here. If you buy them from Ed at the golf shop, they're 50 cents each, nearly new, reprocessed, or cleaned up. So there's our ball, everybody knows what our ball looks like. But James is a machine, now, <clears throat> he's in his 30s, prime of life. I'm 88, I'm well past my prime, but I can still use my machine. The club is a tool, so the four specters, we learned how to, how to approach and you, you have the tarmac and the helicopter approaches differently than a propeller plane or a yeah. jet plane. So, you want it to look the same every time, though. Yeah, yeah. And my other pilot student, Dan Lonneman, he, he, he piloted for Delta, commercial airline. He famously, he said famously, I'm known for having the same amount of landings that I had at a takeoff. So I think that's commendable. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Okay, let's go through a little sequence. So step up, this is just a dry swing next to the ball. So now let's see your impact or landing position. So we want, we want shaft lean, we want all our forces leaning forward and we want that heel up, that's perfect. Now go back to your delivery, your, your approach area, you're coming in the airport. Now what you've done is lift this left heel he's got his back turned nicely he's got his left lat very stretched that big muscle and then he's the right scapula is bent over now we got a little bend in the left arm so now that we talked about how to keep that extended and that's having the elbow pit of the elbow pointing up so this is not comfortable now how do we release drop that that left heel and rotate the hips violently. Drop the heel, and there you go. And hold it for three seconds. Be real tall, proud, a little more straight. There you go. Okay, so now let's put that into effect on the ball. What happened there? I, that was one of the shortest. <laughs> I think that went six feet. How did you do that? It's a trick shot. So what, low point of awareness, right, yeah, James? low point of awareness. So you hit behind it, and hitting the big ball before you do the little ball never yeah. works. So now, we've been working on at weed control, digging weeds out. So that's just a weed, take it out by the roots. Yep. So I know we're doing some uh, separate things, but we wanna think it feel fluid and feel those parts working. How was that? That was, good. that was pretty good, huh? Yeah. It felt good. You're holding it for three seconds. That's the gallery post. Congratulations, sir. <laughs> I think you're passing the flight uh, <laughs> requirements. <laughs> well, you're not quite there, but. <laughs> so you learned some things? Yes, sir. Keep working on it, though. Yeah, and, and practice makes perfect, but no, it's perfect practice makes perfect. Yes, sir. <laughs> Congratulations on that. <laughs>